I remember we did this BLM march and I really didn't understand what we was marching for. They was asking for all the queers to come out and whatnot. And we came out and this dude was just drugging up gay people and mostly black males and drugging them up, raping them and leaving them outside. And he was giving them gifts to shut up. And I really feel like it's the motive behind it. I don't know what the man's motive was that was giving all these women HIV. I don't know what the man's motive was for drugging up these gay dudes and all this other good stuff, what other bad stuff, but they got a motive behind it and them niggas need to do time. Welcome back to another great episode of the Gas Mask Tribe TV podcast where we filter out that book. Entertainers can get away, obviously, with murdering 600 people without being caused for it. That's what I'm trying to show you here. Damn the HIV part. He's an entertainer. Let's just look at the entertainer part, right? Just the entertainer. The HIV part is a whole nother aspect of life. That's just a whole okay. nother subject. I'm just like, okay. I'm not an expert in that world, so I generally don't speak on the HIV part. And which is still foul. I'm not taking, I'm not negating that. You know, that shit is still foul, right? But what I'm saying is to have a, a DJ murder or a person who's of an entertainer essence kill over some odd many people and nobody, like, nobody, like, nobody how reported you, it. Like, how did how it get to 600? You, how can it get to even 100? Right, that's what I was without, saying earlier. Without, hold on, hold on. There's an interview with Blueface and Big for Power 106. When Blueface, he's like, yo, how many females do you get? He go, he go, five or six, he go, a thousand. Big go, I'm about to look up the clip right now. Why you bullshit? Okay. Right, 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 right. But that still, that still doesn't answer... That still doesn't answer the fact that cool he might like, have had two thousand females. Like how did it? How did it get? To, he didn't kill two thousand females. Totally different. Totally yeah, different. If he had HIV and didn't know it, or he did know it, was was it matter? How, I mean, uh, I mean, I, I when to, how I was like to stay it's, it's trying. I know what business. I know what business trying to say. Like how did it get? How did it wait? Like what took so long? For it to be 600 within any amount of time, like, for money. it to get to 600, money. they said he was giving gifts and cat and prizes and not prizes, but gifts and stuff like that and money to him. Did you if you hear the clip? It says he was giving gifts and this and oh, that. Oh, to stop them from telling them? I, I, no, he was just. It's like a female coming, you be like, yo, here, here's some money, boom, boom, boom. And then but that's a lure tactic, though. It is. Right. It is. But we're talking about after talking the about fact. After the fact. After you lured a man, after you did what you like did. The report of 600. Like that, okay, so, like so, so the report of 50 is, is, is even mind boggling, right? But the to, report not, of, to not be able to report him. I get what you're saying. I get what you said. How can he not get reported over 600 females? On 50. Let's say, let's just right. say 50. <laughs> On 50, right. Was a, Michael Jackson said it best. Smooth criminal. What the fuck do you want from me? I don't know. I just Smooth criminal? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that guy fucked 600 bitches and got away with it. And he didn't make time to Obviously, he did something right. That's a smooth criminal motherfucker. Or he messed with a lot of them. No, I'm just saying, what? like, all right, let's just say how the system is set. Like, why, why, like, that's how did system. it, what, like, was it reported? Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, like, when is it reported? Is it reported after? Do, do we, do we know when, like, you know, let's pull it up. All right. Pull it up. So, and, and, you know, if we're going to keep going okay. in on this. Right, we well, well, I don't want to, I, I do want to, <laughs> our job is not to come up with the tools to give everybody to like, yo, this is exactly what happened. Our job is just to help filter it out. We and the answer, swank. You know what I mean? <laughs> and if we're just looking at this at face value, DJ with HIV kills over 600 black women, like that's crazy. And just off that title alone. Like how did like, it get to that number? How did it, how get, did it get, to get to that, that number? Why? It's like if you're gonna filter something out like that, only way I can get about see, I would you know, get about him because he's yeah he's yeah we know all right there's a, there was a mission for him but them get, finding out six is six hundred like 
that's crazy. Like, how did it get that report? Like the report of six hundred. Like, <laughs> now, like who who did like? That's crazy. Like, if you know you had it, or maybe some of them didn't know they had it, and they just died, and then like they didn't tell them. Like, how? Huh? And then they find out when they when that person passed away, nobody found out. Like, or they just passed away in the same time. Like, what? Right. Like, like what's like? Those are, there's a lot of questions. I know. <laughs> I know. It passed at the I same just, time. And then the, to... autop the autopsy read that it was from the, like that's a lot of investigation. Well, I def <laughs> my my whole thing was so I definitely want to be able to like under like get people to understand like being an entertainer, life is awesome. Why? Because there's stuff that we get away with that most people won't. And Ooh. You know what I mean? And it's like, it's foul to say publicly because that's like kind of a thing that us as entertainers don't really talk about. You know what I mean? We go around, people give us stuff free, you know, they give us free shoes. Hey, eat. I mean, I remember me and Rick was going around LA just eating for free just because we knew people. You know what I mean? It was just like, we didn't have to work as hard as others, you know? And that's really a huge thing in entertainment world. Yes, we have the great talent of being an entertainer, and we're given this thing because of the people. You know, we're given this exposure, this love, this praise. You know, all by y'all. You know what I mean? But it doesn't it doesn't change right from wrong, right? And as an entertainer, some of us do a lot of foul shiznit. And some of us do a lot of great stuff. But the stuff that get more exposure is this stuff that's foul. That's the fucked up part about it. You know what I mean? This would get more exposure. DJ having sex with a transmitted sexual disease and giving it to other women who are of a dem certain demographic and literally doing that to not one, not a hundred, but over 600. That's freaking crazy anyway just had to kind of filter out that bull you know Razo, what's, what's good the Rob? what's the dinner now i just came in hey. the house and got the link what's going on y'all Razi. i'm just loving the real nigga the real nigga comments Rob. like just the point of view y'all y'all shedding on it that's some real nigga shit only thing i'm gonna comment on was the fact that i think the entertainers do get away with a lot of shit and i i i feel that i see that um but really, I feel like what made the connection, what made me put this, let me just start from the top. Ed Buck. I remember we did this BLM march, and I really didn't understand what we was marching for. They was asking for all the queers to come out and whatnot. And we came out, and this dude was just drugging up gay people, and mostly black males, and drugging them up, raping them, and leaving them outside. And he was giving them gifts to shut up. And I really feel like it's the motive behind it. I don't know what the man's motive was that was giving all these women HIV. I don't know what the man's motive was for drugging up these gay dudes and all this other good stuff, or other bad stuff, but they got a motive behind it and them niggas need to do time. That's it. That's it, that nigga need to do time. Like that's, that, that nigga, he need to be under somebody's jail. Like that's some, that's some, that's some weird shit. <laughs>